jealous they couldn't be here tonight. Capaldi by nature at the official XWA. I'm so jealous that I'm not at the Warwick show right now. I'll be at the next one. Glad you guys are doing live again. You can get first from the Bronx, New York, weighing in at 185, the Boy, Jared Diaz made his debut at XWA Throwdown about six weeks ago. Ever since then, he has certainly been a fan favorite. And that's what's put him on this card here tonight at XWA Unbreakable. This could certainly be one of the biggest challenges of his career to date as he takes on Hot Fire Myron Reed. Making his debut here at the XWA. How's those tweets looking? We get I'm we get sure. twitted? I'm Are we get twitted? I'm trying to see who's watching from home. We got a few people tweeting at us. I want to hear your predictions throughout the night. Send us a message, the official XWA. And right now, you might not though, because your eyes have been fixated on young upstart Jared Diaz. This guy's put his body on the line on Thursday nights for no reason. His debut here at the XWA. He won his body through those ropes. With reckless abandon, it was nothing like like nothing I, I've ever seen before. So this kid, he's gonna bring it all on the table. And Myron Reed, hot fire for a reason. intensity in his eyes as he goes in the ring to face Jared Diaz. Both men of similar stature here, both men around the same weight, around the same height. Should be an interesting competition here. Do we reinforce these overhead lights though? That's my question. Never mind the ring. It's everything above these guys I'm worried about. Yes sir, this should certainly be a fast-paced high-action matchup. As we see these two do their thing in the middle of an XWA ring. Yeah. 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 Diaz fans here. A lot of Thursday night attendees. Also some Myron Reed fans here tonight excited for his debut. What, what exactly is a what exactly is a bodega boy? I don't know what a bodega boy is, Bob. I think we've went over this before on other occasions, but uh, I'm not sure I don't own a bodega. Okay. Rich, any idea? A, a bodega is actually a, like a very small grocery slash convenience store found in uh, a lot of the... So uh, he sells fruit. Uh, more than fruit. You can get a protein bar. You get an, uh, a Is that where he got his Arizona, Arizona iced tea? Yeah. Yes, all right. Fair enough. Okay. Can, we, can we say Arizona iced tea? We I don't know. Did, but, uh, uh, you know. We'll find out. They're, and we're pulled. They're all over New York City, uh, Manhattan, the Bronx, and uh, he's the bodega boy, Jared Diaz. Oh my God, but Myron Reed pushing pressure on that elbow. Match starting off a little slower than I had expected. First time meeting for both these competitors. Feeling each other out. Jared Diaz, Diaz trying to make a name for himself, somewhat new to the business. Just a little green, maybe some would say. I don't know. A little wrist lock there. Simple but effective, keeping Myron Reed in place. Which is what you want to do with someone like Myron Reed. Once he starts, going, that's when things go off. Talk to Jared Diaz last week when he was here at Throwdown. He's certainly been scouting Myron Reed, trying to strategize against his opponent. Back to the collar and elbow. Reed gets the headlock. Talk about two hungry young athletes you got it right here in this match and like you guys said at the outset i'm expecting some high flying here big shoulder tackle diaz goes down hard 
Uh, you gotta wonder if Diaz underestimated Myron Reed going into this match. Gorgeous leapfrog. Reed stops himself, rolls Diaz through, sends him out with the line. Here we go. Right over the Whoa. top, cross body to the floor. Reed back to his feet with ease. Zero, you know what's given right there as Myron Reed soars over the top rope. Drops that 175 pounds across the chest of Jared Diaz. Throws him back into the ring as the match continues. Hot fire, Myron Reed. A very, very talented young athlete originally. Ooh. Gets that scissor kick in the back of the head. He's originally from that Dayton, Ohio area that has brought such great athletes as Trey Miguel, Sammy Callahan, Ace Austin, who we know very well. All from that same camp. Many of whom we've seen here at the XWA. Yeah, right? Absolutely. Big power slam by Diaz. Only a one count, says Ref Q. Reed outside the ring. I've seen this set up before. I don't know if Reed knows where he's at. Perfect spot for Diaz. Going for him, but Reed back in. Up on the shoulders. Oh, oh, oh. Spikes up on his knee. Two count. Count of two as the match continues. The, the uh, young goat himself, Myron Reed, actually two-time and current MLW. World Middleweight Champion, uh, title that he takes very seriously. Of course, it's not a sanctioned Major League Wrestling event. This is the XWA. But that is a title that he holds very proudly for a second time. He's held numerous championships. And, you know, if Jared Diaz can pull off the victory here, you know, he's going to be looking for bigger opportunities, not only here in the XWA, but throughout the wrestling world as Reed lands on his feet. A lot of eyes on tonight's event as once again we are live on Fight TV. Thank you for joining us guys here for Unbreakable. Big off from Diaz. Reed fires off for the big boot. And that's just getting a little fiery now. Completely killing any momentum that Diaz might have had heading into that. Now through the ropes to the outside. Oh jeez. Oh, no. Reed's going to fly. Dive through the ropes. Comes crashing down. Right into the fence over here. I'm glad we have a fence in front of our, uh, our broadcast booth right? here. Just another layer of nothing to crash through us. We are certainly protected tonight. How about that guy? Both men back in the ring now. Myron. Still showing no signs of exhaustion. Myron Reed back over the top rope. Myron Reed looking to make this his match. Sent over by Diaz. Swing and a miss. Reed back in. Going for that. Backstabber. The momentum carrying Diaz back to the center of the ring and Myron Reed's going to his favorite part of the ring up to that top rope. Hot fire! Crushes him. Two! Put, oh, almost put him away. Only a two count. Reed launching himself off that top rope. Great match thus far here tonight. This whole event has been something spectacular. Reed just big stomp right to the back. Still a lot more to come, Rich. Of course, JT Dunn taking on Leo Rush. We'll be seeing that one. Of course, Team Steel going against Team Buff Inc. And then a big main event, XWA Championship on the line. Trigger the OG defense against Kellen Thomas. And a no hold barred. All Speaking those of, matches coming, and we've got Flash Waller against Alex Ryman coming up next. I was thinking of the uh, Team Buff versus Team Steel. We still don't know who's going to be in that matchup. Yeah, we, have, we haven't revealed th th who their whole teams have been. There have been plenty of rumors as who it could be, but again, like you said, John, we just don't know. The rumor mill right now is running rib as Myron Reed again taking it to Jared Diaz in the middle of the ring. Myron Reed just wearing his opponent down. Reed from Louisville, Kentucky. Diaz from the Bronx. Oh, gets a shot off to break that hold. Oh, look at the agility of Reed. Oh! Fires off the end to Gary, taking down Diaz. And Reed lining him up now in that corner, going in for the kill. Diaz manages to send him over the top. Oh. Reed right back in, going for the monkey flip. Delivered, but Diaz lands on his feet. 
Missile drop kick sends Reed into the corner and both men down. Both men down on the canvas. Cue the ref tolling the count as the action continues here in tonight's fifth bout. Five of nine, ladies and gentlemen. We're just at the halfway point of tonight's event. We thank you for checking out the XWA here tonight on Fight Ooh. TV. Oh, good shot, by Diaz. Forearm connects. Backs him into the rope here, whips him off. Beats that drop kick. Reed backing off into that corner, getting out of the way. Doesn't see Diaz. Oh! Nails that uppercut. Going for a bulldog. Delivered! 100%! Coming in for the pin. Q on two. Stopping before three. So now, Jared Diaz, young athlete out of the Bronx, is questioning what's his next move? What do I have to do to defeat Myron Reed? Oh! Probably avoid that. Yeah. For starters, yes. Reed going up to the top. Trying to get that footing, maybe not. Diaz up there with him now. High risk area. Reed trying to block it. Going for a superplex. Oh, no. oh, all the way up top. Dangerous. Going even higher. Ooh. To the outside. Manages to get a kickoff, springboarding off the top rope. And that's a three to the outside now. Diaz needs to capitalize. Let's see if he's going to keep it in the ring. I doubt it. Oh! oh! Front flip to the outside, and both men disappeared. Referee yes! quickly checking on both athletes as that was a very rough landing as the match apparently will continue. And a Diaz chant beginning in the crowd here. Putting his body on the line for sure tonight is Diaz as he goes for the cover. Hooks the leg. This could be it. No. Two count once again. Both men putting their bodies on the line here tonight. Soft. Very similar styles clashing right here in this match. Each athlete trying to outshine the other. Reed has barely moved. Hit him again, go for a suplex. No, turn through it. Hanging on. Diaz stepping through. Ooh. Too slow though, he hits the forearm. Too much time wasted. Elbow to the back of the head and Diaz slumped down on the apron. Ooh, and a big well-placed boot right to the mouth. Think you ever got one of those at the bodegas? Oh. Doubt it, right? A bodega boot? A bodega boot? <laughs> I think he wants to finish that iced tea. He wants to uh, have a celebratory iced tea drink. One of those spiked ones. Maybe it is. Oh, pops him up. Power bomb from Diaz. Two. No. Enough to put him away. Did you see the height on that? Myron Reed with just enough left in the tank to kick out of that one. But like you mentioned, John, good thing we reinforced those lights tonight because he almost hit the ceiling. Did we? No, I asked you if we reinforced the lights. I don't think oh, we ever so we got have an answer. We don't know for sure. I don't know. Well, find out, would you? <laughs> I'll ask. Send a text. Reed's the first one to his feet. Diaz charges in, catches the boot, and literally caught that one right in the side of the head. Brings him up oh! Top, drives him high on the neck into the canvas. Fireman's carry. Myron Reed taking Diaz to the ropes. Ooh, perfectly Diaz! timed. This could be it. Oh, he cannot believe it. Look at the expression on Myron Reed's face. That DDT planted Jarrett Diaz right in the center of the ring. Couldn't hold him down for three. Myron Reed is stunned, plots his next maneuver. Waiting for him to get up here, hoist him up. Diaz fighting, tries to get out, now on the apron. He's in second to hang on, delivered a kick to the back of the head. Oh, catches himself. Oh, super kick. Hats off to Diaz, almost lost his footing up there on the top rope, but connects. Oh, 
he wow, Cal just hit into a cutter. He sure did. He's going high risk now. Going for the cutter again. Stopped by Diaz. Reed turns him inside out. Again reversed. Look at oh. this. Myron Reed controlling the body. Air raid crash. Got him. That's it. That's it. Myron Reed, your winner here against Jared Diaz. Here is your winner, Hunt Fire, Myron Reed. Myron Reed successful in his endeavors tonight as the Bodega boy lies in the middle of the ring taking the L. But up next, guys. Oh, man, up next. It's going to be a good one. Plenty of time to tell that story, I'm sure. The past few weeks, Alex Ryman, Flash Waller, not even the past few weeks, the past few months, 